we look at the patient as a whole, and the management of these disease processes is often not just surgical, but often medical. We're not here just to do a procedure on a patient. We're here to take care of them as a person, manage them medically, and then surgically when necessary. One of the reasons I decided to join this group is because I met a group of absolutely outstanding vascular surgeons, each and every one of them who are just phenomenal um, doctors, surgeons, and individuals. We rely on our partners and our PAs. We talk about patients um, routinely on a daily basis. We seek each other out for advice and input, and we work great together. We're not here just to do a procedure on a patient. We're here to take care of them as a person. We don't restrict ourselves to a small subset of diseases. And we can offer any service to our patients that they need uh, from start to finish. And we'll stand by our patients to the end. I've found that if patients understand their disease process, they're, they have a better understanding of what's going on. They're able to take care of themselves and pursue the medical and non-surgical treatments that we recommend. Um, so I really try to spend the time to explain these disease processes to the patients when I see them in our, in our office. One of the things I enjoy about this job is meeting people from a variety of different backgrounds and speaking to them and getting to know them. And one of the other things I love about vascular surgery is the continuity that you get from year to year, sometimes decade to decade with these patients. And you get very close to some of these patients. I want them to remember me for being a good doctor, for having taken good care of them, being by their side, and as someone they trust and who they would send their, their loved ones to.